Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Taurus. This is for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for the next seven days. It's being recorded on the 8th, but you could say the 8th through the 16th, okay? The eight, or seven days from the date that you watch it, okay? So what do we have for Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? This card just fell out. Tower, solid foundation, success with effort. So you're going to be finding some sort of success. Maybe you're building a strong foundation, focusing on your foundation. Flowers, happiness, happiness. So something is making you happy this week. Focusing on your happiness, focusing on your foundation. Now, your foundation could be your body, could be your home, could be a relationship, could be a job, whatever it is. I think that, that there's success, it's solid, and there's happiness. A message is coming because that bird is, birds are messengers, that bird is perched. So I think that you may, maybe you've been waiting for something, I don't know. There's something that is coming that is going to make you happy. At the right place at the right time you may find yourself at the right place at the right time you may also be seeing an increase of money what else do we got for Taurus messenger interesting but I just said that about the bird birds deliver messages or oh, a card fell out that I did not see, it slipped right out the end, the end of something, the end of something. So I don't know what, it could be the end of suffering. I don't know, the end, it's the end of something, the end of some sort of story, the end of a phase, something is coming to the end. A messenger, you're gonna, there's a message that is coming. I know that there is. You're in at the right place at the right time. So you may find yourself at the right place at the right time. Something spontaneous could happen. What do we got for Taurus? Ooh. We got two cards. We got the King of Pentacles and the Eight of Swords reversed. So there's an obstacle that is being removed. Okay, some sort of obstacle is being removed. If you've been in a place of fear, that's being removed. You could also be dealing with a person that is removing an obstacle. Um, the King of Pentacles could be you. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, it could also be anybody else, but it could be you that has you know, worked hard to achieve success because that is the highest achievement, right? The King of Pentacles. This is somebody that works hard. It may be somebody that is, that is a very hard worker that has been held back by fear or they've been in some sort of mental conflict and it could be you. It could be you or it could be another person. This is an obstacle that is being removed. There's some sort of stability that is coming towards you. Um, whether it is an increase in money or it's an, or somebody it could actually be a person. Um, this person is very established, has worked hard for all that they have, maybe very wealthy. Um, it could be you. I mean, that definitely could be you, but there is definitely an obstacle that is being removed. I see stability, financial stability, financial security, secure with yourself as well. If somebody has been tied to a situation, they're breaking free from it. Seven of Wands, putting up a fight. Uh, that's right now the basis of this reading. Maybe you've been protecting yourself. You've been standing your ground, pushing people away. I don't know. This is standing your ground. That's the basis of this situation, refusing to budge. You know, maintaining a position. Five of Pentacles revert or upright behind you in the past. So this is some sort of uh, struggle. It's a power struggle. All fives are power struggles. Hard times, burdens, um, abandonment perhaps. I don't know if you were abandoned or neglected or outcast or 
Um, you've been in some sort of, well, there's been a lack of help, not getting any help. Or, or I don't know if you were ghosted or abandoned, neglected, or you were led in the wrong direction. Um, refusing, ref I feel like you've been refusing to budge on something. Um, maybe you were refusing to accept help from somebody. There's some sort of, maybe in the past there were some financial burdens as well. I mean, the Five of Pentacles can be financial burdens. So I don't know if you were struggling financially. If you were, that's going to change. We saw that increase in money and the King of Pentacles is the ultimate abundance, okay? It's a hard worker who has achieved success through hard work and perseverance, whether that's you or somebody that is coming into your life. Four of Cups, that's the present. So we got somebody here that is thinking about an opportunity. They're thinking, I mean, that's the Ace of Cups. They're thinking about love, okay? So I don't know if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with, but that's uh, wanting more, wanting more. So right now we got somebody here that is interested. This person appears to be interested. They're looking at it. They're interested. I, I'm not sure if somebody, you know, I'm not sure if you were protecting yourself in some way you have your guard up you may have many options that seven of wands that's that's a lot of options um four of cups that's somebody that is very interested i don't know if you're starting to get interested in somebody or somebody is getting interested in you this really looks like somebody is interested they're interested they're really looking at it this is an opportunity for love okay new love or a reconciliation for some of you, if that's what you want. You know, I don't know if that's what you want. But uh, anyhow, the Four of Cups, I mean, that cup is right there and somebody is looking at it. It's like they, I feel like they were ignoring it, but they're not, it does, that looks like they're not ignoring it anymore. Three of Wands in your future. Get prepared, get prepared. There's going to be an arrival. I believe that you have an arrival here. Somebody may be coming to visit or you're going to visit them. This could be arrival or departure. Uh, a decision is being made or it has been made. It's about to be made because that is in the future. The three of wands, the future is look, looks bright. This is big plans for the future. Um, I feel that for some of you, this is getting your bags packed, going somewhere. Maybe you're, you're getting ready to go somewhere or somebody's getting ready to come to you. Um, this is focusing on the future. Ready, ready, ready. The decision has been made. The decision has, this is like a done, done with the stalemate. The decision has been made. So somebody is making a decision to focus on the future. They're going in a new direction. There could be some sort of traveling here. I don't know if you're going somewhere and you run into somebody. Two of wands reverse. That's very interesting. That's down in your advice. You've, you've been stalling. You've been procrastinating. There's been fear of the unknown. You need to step into unknown territory. Focus on the future. Focus on the future. Let go of your fears. And that is the Eight of Swords reverse. Let go of your fears. Mm. Knight of Pentacles. So this is a solid opportunity that's coming your way. Whoever, this is your outside influence. So you are dealing probably with another earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. If not, this is somebody that is a hard worker. This is somebody that is uh, down to earth, laid back, doesn't rush, plans things, moves slowly. Um, you could be dealing with a planner. You know, this is somebody that has some sort of skill. This could, somebody, this could be somebody that does something, you know, for a skill. They have a skilled trade. Um, yeah, somebody is coming in, coming towards you. And it feels like you're going towards them. It's interesting. Knight of Pentacles, this is a hard worker. This, you're going to be getting a golden opportunity, a secure offer from somebody. This is somebody that is loyal. That This is somebody that is loyal. Or 
solid, you know? For some of you, this could even be a business opportunity. This could be from somebody that is afar. There could be a distance as well. The moon in your hopes and fears. So I feel like there's a lot of fear. There's an unclear and difficult path ahead. There's hidden forces here. There could be an unexpected blessing that is coming in because the pentacle that is held by the king of pentacles and the knight of pentacles are blessings. It's something that you asked for. It's something that you manifested. So you may have manifested something. There's definitely some sort of happiness here. This is the end of, of struggle because the five of pentacles is in the past. We have the end card. If you've been struggling financially, it's all coming to an end. There is an increase. You may be getting a job opportunity or, or somebody may be making you a proposal or somebody is coming towards you that has some, some sort of money. I mean, the Knight of Pentacles lays foundations. This is somebody that's very down to earth, very laid back, um, has been doing something for a long time, is very interested in um, long term success. And, and so this is somebody that doesn't just do things impulsively. What's the overall outcome? Seven of Pentacles reverse. I don't know if there's a relocation here. Three of Wands is a relocation, perhaps. And this could be a relocation as well. Um, something that you planted a long time ago may be coming to fruition now. Or this is a dead end. I'm not sure. This is dissatisfying. It's unrealistic. There's a need to plant seeds someplace else. There's a need to go someplace else. Let's get another card for that. Hermit. Hermit is re-identification, thinking, planning, planning your next move. You're gonna be you're gonna be put going into hermit mode. You're gonna be getting an offer from somebody that this could be the end of loneliness. For some of you. Uh, the hermit reverse no, it's not reverse, it's upright. The hermit is going within, thinking, planning your next move, soul searching. I think that's the overall outcome. Is this realistic? Is this Practical, because you're all about being practical, right? Um, all is not as it seems. There is something that is below the surface that is about to be shown to you. The light is going to be shed on something. Somebody has been thinking. They have been thinking. They have been planning. There's some sort of change that is coming, a realignment of some sort. This is a geometric power that is realigning you. You're going you're gonna to be put in a position where you have to make a choice whether you want to take that next step, okay? Um, seven of Wands, the basis of this situation. You're going to be caught off guard. You're caught. going to be caught off guard. That is it right there. It's like having your guard up. You're going to be caught off guard. This is trying to find balance, you know, needing to be flexible. You need to be flexible. You need to be flexible. You're going to have to make a choice. You are going to have to make some sort of choice. What is this four of cups? Do you want it or not? Do you want it or not? Some of you may have to do with leaving. Maybe you're leaving somebody to be alone. This is unrealistic. It's not practical. There's a lot of secrets. There's a lot of lies. Maybe you've secured another opportunity and that will require you to end that old cycle of your life. I feel like you. some of you are gaining or you've gotten another opportunity or you're about to get another opportunity that can break you free because the eight of swords is freedom. It's removing an obstacle. If you've been trapped or tied to a situation that has caused you a lot of mental turmoil, this could be the end of that, okay? I feel like you're gonna receive an offer that can break you free from something. This is something solid, it's something real, okay? Somebody, and this is a generous offer. It is a generous offer. It can break you free from some sort of, I don't know, obstacle or mental turmoil. This is something that you could love. 
This is an opportunity for love that you could love. I mean, you could really love this opportunity. It may have to do with a new home for some of you. Some of you could be leaving somebody that neglected you, that abandoned you, that um, cost you a lot of money as well. You know, maybe, you, maybe you're living in fear because somebody used you. They took advantage of you, so you don't trust. That could certainly be the case because I see protective mode. Maybe you're in protective mode. Maybe you just don't trust anybody. That is probably the case. That's interesting. This is distrustful. So you may have your guard up. You may, I think you're definitely going to be caught off guard by an opportunity that is coming your way. You may see this person as an enemy because of fear. There is definitely fear here with the moon, the two of wands reversed and that eight of swords. You need to be open-minded. Get prepared, okay? Something is coming. Something in your future looks bright. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. That's the three of wands. Get ready. What is the three of wands? The Queen of Pentacles. So this is money. Something to do with money. Finding it in this perfect match. Right? Okay, it goes the King of Wands. The Queen of Wands. I mean, the, the King of Pentacles. The Queen of Pentacles. And the Three of Wands. So this is a perfect match. It's a perfect couple. These people have the same values. The same, va the same values. Get prepared. Something that you, you've asked for. That you've been waiting for. Because Three of Wands is waiting. You've been waiting for this. This is something real, it's something solid, something stable. Um, you're getting, and I feel like you're gonna take it. Uh, look at that. So somebody is gonna be, it's like you're getting an opportunity from somebody. May require travel, I don't know. I don't know if you're gonna be moving or what, or not, or somebody's moving towards you. But there is get prepared, that three of wands is get prepared. Okay, this is spreading your ring, wings, not looking back, not looking back, focusing on the future. So an obstacle is being removed. Maybe it's your fear because this is protective mode. Some of you may be getting a proposal. You may be getting a proposal or a job offer or something like that, whatever it is. I don't know what it is, but that Knight of Pentacles is something real. It's something solid. It's something that, you know, with hard work and perseverance will grow into the ultimate abundance. It will. You're going to have to think. You're going to have to think. Light is going to be shed on some sort of situation. There's an unclear and difficult path ahead. You need to replace your fear, okay? You need to replace your fear. I can see fear of the unknown, that two of wands reverse. That's indecision. It's fear of change, you know? There could definitely be a sudden arrival with the two of wands reversed as well. So something is coming in. It's, 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 uh, it's something that you asked for. It's something that you manifested. It's somebody that you have shared values with. There's somebody that you have a lot in common with. There's gonna be, or so, this person sees some sort of skill in you. Um, we have two business-oriented people that are going to be working together. What's the, let's get one more card on that outcome. The end. Nine of cups. This is wish fulfillment. This is extreme. This is pleased as punch. This is like, oh my God, I'm so happy. This is emotionally fulfilled. This is, this is over the top. Okay, this is this is happy, happy. This is realizing your dreams as well. Or there's somebody that you're deal dealing with that is realizing their dreams. This is a card of dreams and the, and the hermit is realizing. So whether you're realizing your dreams or you're going after happiness or whatever, okay? This is happy. This is extremely happy, okay? Um, I don't know. For some of you, you may even be in the spotlight with that hermit, which is a light. And this is, you know, being admired and, or being so, so, so happy. Congratulations, whatever that means. Happiness. This is, week is going to end on a happy note. 
okay? Something is happening. You're going to find yourself at the right place at the right time. You're going to receive some sort of offer that you asked for or you manifested. This is something that you can take to the bank, right? It's a real solid offer. Maybe it's even an offer from a bank. I don't know. Um, whatever it is, it's something It's something solid. Um, it could be a proposal. It could be from another person. We have a couple here. We have two people. Okay, we have king and queen of pentacles. It doesn't matter what signs they are. This is a perfect match. Okay? Get prepared. Get prepared, okay? Get prepared. Now, I'm not sure you can be. But your future looks bright. And I think this is like... A need to replace your fear. You need to step out of your fear, okay? Um, or somebody that you're dealing with is stepping out of their fear. Maybe they neglected you. I'm not sure what is going on, but you are going to be receiving a stable, solid offer, okay? Or a proposal from somebody. All right? Good luck.